Hello and welcome back to our Teutonic Order campaign in Mayo and Taxes 2. Uh, we have provinces in turmoil. Damn, not good. So let's have a further look at the special map mode. Give me, give me a pop up. Give me a pop up. Hmm, seems like something's happening. There it is. So, as I said, we got a bunch of things here. I'm going to have a look at hmm, economic indicators. Uh, province wealth. Make province wealth visible in trade map mode. Alright. So now if we look at the trade map mode, we can see the province wealth. So who has a lot of wealth? Well, these northern Germans have a bit local wealth. Ooh, there's quite a lot here. Who owns this? Cologne. The, uh, yeah, the uh, low countries have a lot of money. Major center of trade, they all make like luxury cloth. It's, um, historically, this area was very, very rich. Um, let's see, weather and rainfall. Yeah, this is what I wanted to show you before, because I find it funny that the mod tracks where rain happens. Like, really? That's kind of hilarious. Let's have a look down. It, like, everywhere looks the same, to be honest. Average weather versus average weather. I don't any... I doubt a single Scottish person would say that their weather was average. Let's remove those. But yeah, it's, it's just amazing. I love it. So we have gems here. This is our mind good. We get a lot of trade value out of that. Holy shit. Oh no, we lost some sailors. How much do I give a fuck? Not even a little bit. So, sailors, um, they're still useless. They're always going to be useless. They're a very... They're just useless. Let, let's just let's just leave it at that. Uh, we need to form a claim on the mighty. Nice, thank you. Um, yeah, the mod devs have uh, talked about what they would like to put in its place. Um, one suggestion was uh, changing it to lumber. So, you know, you need to repair your ships with something, and that something is wood, lumber. Um, so that could be something, I don't know, maybe, what would you change it to? I'm, I'm curious, what, what would you change sailors to? Um, take Zimichi. That is a lot of modifiers that I could get. Improve relations with Kamin, that looks like an easy one. Improve prestige is not so easy. Uh, let's improve relations with Kamen. I think that's you, yes. Um, can I have my spy network guy back? Oh shit, wait a minute, this is something. Uh, our court spending in the last year is a result in a change in our court level. It's now respectable. What was it before? Uh, let's have a look at our estate. Bob and the court. The grandeur and prestige of a country is oftentimes inseparable from the splendor of its royal court. Aside from the naked displays of wealth, elements of a nation's court include artists, intellectuals, entertainers, opulent feasts, towering palaces, blah de blah de blah. Higher court level will slightly improve the loyalty and stability points made from the semi random events which improve loyalty. It's lowering quite fast, so yeah, I think we were at level 4. I think we need to. Hmm. We need to increase our funding, I think. Give you five ducats a year. Uh, let's have a look at our education. Has that changed? I don't think that has changed. Uh, let's give you five ducats as well. Oh no, two is, two is fine. Two ducats annually. Hopefully that doesn't tank my income. Just take it at the end of the year. 
Oh, it did tank my income. Damn. Well, I would like to get a bit more rural pop here so that I have more people to work the gems. Because local wealth is 75 ducats. Number of taxable ducats are currently in circulating saved in the local economy. As the promise generates wealth, that wealth accumulates over time. The higher the wealth, the more your government can tax from it, causing a small percentage to go from the province to your treasury. Once local wealth reaches at least half the ducat value of the province infrastructure, those ducats are spent by local powers on new buildings and infrastructure. Ah, that's how it works. So, it's 450. When this reaches half of this, they'll spend on buildings. Interesting. Accumulated wealth in a province is vulnerable to looting by enemy armies, and when the province is occupied, the percentage of the wealth is sieged, seized and a percentage destroyed. Hmm, interesting. The higher the province's urban infrastructure value, the more costly it is to build buildings. When a province is looted, it's more perfect. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. That's good to know. How are we doing for pop? This is now a little bit bigger. Now, okay, so we're gaining... We're gaining 1,600 urban pop per year. So yeah, being undersaturated, really good. Our gravity is kind of huge there. Can I build something here? Uh, what would we build? Uh, that would increase our urban gravity. Shipwright, that would be pretty good, I think. What's this? Oh yeah, I completely forgot about alliances. Alliance from Sfaria. Um, I'd rather be allied to Denmark, to be honest, but they've reached their alliance limit. So to get more allies, they need to improve their court level. You don't have any allies, so that's why you can ally me. Um, easy way to check who would ally me. Literally just one. And Holland would accept our offer to support their independence. Um, yeah. But you're gonna go to war with Sweden and Denmark again. Hmm. And I would imagine their fleet is stronger than mine, so no. Uh, what can we do here? Oh yeah, choose a policy regarding the vassal. So, after these 149 years are up, that's when we can start annexing. So they're not actually assimilating very fast, because it's a little bit higher than the 10 years. Um, so, I would like to enact a policy. Uh, we could cut down on the tribute, lower the income from vassals, they get blah blah, blah or increase the tribute. How much do we get? 0.18. It's not a lot, is it? I want to increase the tribute. We could also seize our land. That's nice. Uh, hmm. Let's see. What else can we do? I would like to meet with Goswin von Bladula. Uh, factors. Base integration lifetime, 40 years. Centralization, 11% slower. Low Germanic culture group. So, okay, so it's it, as it's the same culture group, um, it goes faster. Admin tech level, um, being a monastic order, three times slower. There, that's why. End in 158 years. Okay. Fair enough. Well, at least it, like, tells you exactly what all the modifiers are and, you know, what you might need to do to change it. If I was to clear war on you, Muscovy and Poland would help. Muscovy? Not so much of a problem. Poland? Quite a big problem. Um, though if they attacked me, that's also a pretty big problem. Though I do have a bunch of forts and, uh, or some woods, right? In my stream, I was playing as Brandenburg, and I attacked a guy that was sieging my Altmark fort, fort, which is a forest. I didn't get the bonus for defending in a forest, but it was a blue fort, 
So I'm thinking maybe it's different if it's a regular fort. I don't know. We'll find out. But I imagine uh, Lithuania is going to attack me at some point. What could we build? A thousand and two gold for a bank. Holy shit. A university would be nice. That would increase the amount of pops that we can uh, conceivably uh, educate. Improve our education level. Warehouse district would be nice. Uh, that helps the uh, rural pops, I believe. Or it doubles the city's growth rate due to imported food. Yeah, okay. We could make a mining complex. No, we can't. What can we make a mining complex? Okay, if we had 230 ducats, we could make an, uh, a mining complex level 3 here. Okay. Build some paved roads or not. We could build some highways or not. Uh, okay. Uh, that's overview only. Fair enough. Need 10,000 ducats to build a road and railway network. Holy shit. Friendly movement seed, though. Plus 250%. That's kind of insane. Um, we're pretty close to some tech. We don't get any boats here, though, unfortunately. The trade harbor in Danzig would be awesome, I think. Is it called Danzig here? Yes. I might trigger some polls here, but I really prefer the name Danzig to, to uh, Gdansk. There we go. Now, I want to look here. Uh... Improving our dock. We have a fishing port rank zero harbor. I would love to build the trade harbor, which is where? Do we need to build the trade wharf? Requirements for the trade wharf rank one trade harbor. Do we not have that? I'm going to trade harbor. Where is that? Who the fuck knows? Get more tech before the uh, institution penalty gets too insane. Huh. That's military harbor. That's a trade harbor. Can't build that anywhere. Can't build that anywhere. Could build that. Okay. At least this way, um, different dockyards and stuff aren't useless. So yay, it gives me sailors. It also gives me naval force limit and local defensiveness and local ship cost and like all of that shit. Urban gravity. So how how much. Um, people are drawn to your cities. Kelmno gets suppressed minority for one year. I would rather take the pain of unrest. Which is not actually all that much. Like, it's, it's only a year. Uh, let's have a look at our stability, see where we're at for the next to stability bump. Timber management. I'll have a look at that afterwards as well. That interests me. We're at 57. Okay, cool. Um, we're at average development level. We get fort defense plus 2.5%. Nice. Substandard gives us my plus 5% tech and idea cost, which sucks balls. Does give us global institution spread. And the core level is just respectable. Could be better. All right, timber management, what is this? Timber is one of the main raw materials for shipbuilding and wood is more commonly used in the construction of cities, uh, especially in some civilizations as Japan. Its trade is one of the most important around the world and vital for naval powers. The more ships will be big and the more good supply of wood would be necessary. Okay, make 10.5 wood. Um, 
Most of that's from ourselves, but it's pretty sizable from the vassal as well. And we consume 0.7. So maybe this, they have already changed it. Uh, changed the sailors. They just need to integrate it. Like, this is a pretty similar situation. We can trade. Ah, oh, somebody buy timber from me. I want to sell my timber. Do we have any urban goods being made? Uh, you have superb, you have only excellent. Hmm. I wonder. So we need to make sure that the uh, communication efficiency over here is good. So that means we need to see, like here it was only quick. I assume here is really slow. Oh no, that's coming from here. Cough there. But when we integrate this, this is going to be really far away from our capital. So we need to make sure that there is some kind of dock somewhere along this line. Um, so that we can communicate effectively with that location. So there's one in Ravala. So that's actually good. Battle influence for prestige. I'll take the prestige. So instead of using the roads all the way there, he'll jump on a boat and then just like sail up to Ravala. That's fine. This looks like a really good city to try and take. I'm just not sure how, uh, how easy it will be to take it. And we get a number of states plus one. That's kind of irrelevant at this point. Oh, we can build another. Um, we have two cavalry. Let's take another halberdier. And I'm actually going to lower the maintenance of my army so we get a bit more money. Just temporarily. Um, how are we doing on your... Ooh, 152. Can we add this? What do we need to be? Only add provinces on the European continent. Uh, is this not Europe? Subcontinent, Commonwealth, Continent, Europe. Like, what? We are in Europe. Hmm. I don't know. I really don't know. Why is our merchant no longer in here? Maybe I just forgot to press the second button. So, have we got any famines or plagues yet? Uh, no. We'd get a pop-up if there was plague. What is that? Principality of Andorra. Interesting. St. Malo. So, province trauma um, can lead to famine. Uh, so... Famine is, obviously, a lot of rural pops are going to die, there's not enough food for everybody to go around. It's a bad situation for everybody involved. Um, but, unlike being sieged and a bunch of your guys killed, it doesn't damage the province. So you've got a lot of potential in your province, and you can bounce back from a, a plague or a, a famine relatively quickly. From being conquered and sacked and looted, not so easy. Um, who do we want to make friends with? Hungary. Junior partner of Bohemia. Really? Wow, Bohemia is really strong. I would love to be your friend.
Uh, let's improve relations with Denmark. Let's improve relations with Brandenburg. Um, Novgorod. You would be a good ally, actually. But we'll come to that in another episode. I want to thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.